Hey there guys, welcome to the next time lapse here on the channel. Apologies for this video being a little late than usual. I had a lot of stuff to get done today, so that's why for the delay here. Uh, this one's not actually going to be a actual painting or art time lapse. This is going to be another functional time lapse where I show you guys kind of how to make something more or less. And um, I'm a huge fan of chapstick and lip balm. I, I always hated having chapped lips as a kid, so I always was trying to find the right kind of lip balm that would work. And uh, my sister's also a huge fan of them as well, so I decided to look around my house and kind of find something I could use for a carrier for the popular, you know, chapstick eggs, which you can see here, the lip balm eggs. And I decided I can probably make something out of duct tape and kind of film for a time lapse here. So this is one of those uh, time lapses you probably don't need to have me film a tutorial for because it's fairly simple exactly what I'm doing. You can kind of follow it along with the time lapse. But I have uh, four different of the chapstick eggs here. I'm going to be using these to kind of form a little case, kind of like a like four peas in a pod. And I'm going to be using that for the duct tape here, making it out of all, all duct tape. So I know someone's going to ask what the flavors are. I believe uh, some of these are mine, some of these are my sister's. There's the blueberry, which I'm working with now. That's the one that got used the most. Uh, there's also the raspberry one there, the pomegranate raspberry, uh, the vanilla bean, and the passion fruit, I think, is the purple one. So I always have a whole bunch of these rolling around the house because since they're shaped like eggs, they kind of get battered around by my cat and everything, and I have to try to find them again. So now I'm going to um, use put a little bit of a flap on top here. Well, like I said before, not exactly something you need to me to film a tutorial for, but it, it is kind of cool how you can kind of stick all these together and kind of make a little holster for them. Almost like a sunglass case, uh, sunglass case but for these, you have, they all kind of fit in there like peas in a pod. I'm also going to work on a little bit of Velcro for the strap here. And this, of course, isn't the end. I'm going to be using a little bit of the purple tape to put the EOS logo on it, which is, of course, the, the creator of the eggs here. And at this point, they kind of rolled all, all over the floor, so I had to pick them all back up again and stick the Velcro down. So here's the EOS logo. I'm going to stick that right directly on top of the uh, thing here because it's they're all made by EOS, so it makes sense. I'm going to zoom in a little bit and use my uh, hobby knife to cut out the logo here. Then, of course, I'm just going to stick this, you know, right on top. So, yeah, it's kind of cool. Definitely don't need a tutorial. It's really simple. If you guys have watched my video on how to make a sunglass case, it's pretty much the same thing. There's a few little differences, but more or less, you got to kind of measure it to go with all the eggs. We'll be having a live stream test coming sometime fairly soon. I'm going to do a little bit of a test uh, with the uh, just the computers I have, and then I'm going to do kind of an unannounced one on the channel. So everyone who kind of just shows up can be a part of the live stream. And then if that works out really well, I'll you know announce an official one to start off the uh, the live streams I'm going to be having on the channel. So definitely working on that. I'm really excited to do that because. Being able to kind of communicate with you guys live is something that I really don't get to do except at the Duct Tape Festival each year. So I definitely want to try to do that on the channel. I can, I can show you guys a whole bunch of wallets and things I've made all live and maybe be able to do things like actually make things on camera in the future. So, so here's the case with the EOS eggs all tucked in just like that. Really cool. And hope you guys liked the video. Watch out for the test for the live stream coming pretty soon within the next three days. So take care.